Hey, what's going on everybody? It is Divine and today I wanted to make a quick video regarding the whole naming controversy because it is such a hot topic. I just wanted to throw my two cents in it. This won't be a very long video, but let's just jump right in and talk about it. All right, so this is the post that everybody is referencing, and this is talking about how naming is actually global. So what that means is people that get to start the playing the game early, which is going to be the EU servers at 8 a.m. CEST time. Um, so that's like a few hours before everybody else does. And what they can actually do is go in, create a name, and lock it in. And no one else can use that name. Now, this is where all the controversy stems from. And nothing is going to stop you guys from going on to the EU servers when they go live. Um, 8 a.m. CEST time is technically, I think, like 10 or 11 p.m. Pacific time, which isn't too bad for uh, West Coast, but East Coast, that's going to be pretty early in the morning, which kind of sucks. Um, but nothing is stopping you guys from going to these EU servers and creating your account to reserve your name. Just note that when you go to try to delete your account, um, sometimes that name might save for a little bit while after until like the servers sync back up. So you might have to wait around for just a little bit before you're able to go back into your server that you want and uh, claim your name, or you might be just sitting there waiting on the, the name screen until it lets you just kind of go all right, so up next we have the server lunch times for basically the global list here. So everything is going to have 8 a.m. for their own time zones, except for Australia, which is set at 9 p.m. Now, I feel like they should have really done a like conversion, so they all launched at the same time. But you know what? I'm not Amazon. I'm not in charge of that. So what do I know? So I would just recommend you guys, if you're very hell-bent on getting your name, use that time zone, convert it to your own. Um, and then just try to log on to that server to, you know, reserve your name if you can. Now, one other thing to note about logging on to these EU servers is you don't actually have to log all the way into the game to create your account. So don't have to fear about like major long queue times or anything like that. You can actually create your character, create your name without actually getting fully into the game where all that queue time starts. So I know a lot of people are going to be trying to do this. So you would think the queue times would be really long and it might not be worth it, but don't worry you do not have to wait in those queue times. So I'm going to assume that many of you are going to wonder my thoughts on the whole naming convention and how I feel about it. Now, I'm not going to lose sleep over it, honestly. Um, if I get my name, I get my name. If I don't, I have plenty of other names that I'm totally comfortable with using. But do I think it sucks? Yes, I do. Um, I totally think that they should have probably done it where the game launched for everybody at the same time and then you just had to worry about waking up when the servers went live. But... Honestly, what can you do at this point? Like I said, I'm not going to lose sleep over it, but it is something that I can understand why people are so upset by. All right, so moving on to the next thing, and that is later on in the post, it people have been kind of spreading misinformation about the whole pre-order bonus items that you get on your account. Now, a lot of people thought that this was actually going to be only used on their first character that they have, but that is not the case. It is actually account bound. So don't feel bad if you're going to go and reserve your name on the EU server and you have a pre-order bonus that you're worried about losing. It is just on your account. So any of your characters will have that pre-order bonus. So that is something I'm glad that they cleared up because there was a lot of misinformation out there, especially early on with the naming thing. So I just kind of wanted to clear that up for you guys. So in case you hadn't seen that, um, maybe you have more and better information now. Now, like I said, I'll post the Reddit post for all this stuff down below. And that's all I have for this video. So I will catch you guys in the next one.